I'm Brett Yukin, and I'm a division engineer for Grain Processing Corporation. Uh, what I what I do is uh, basically any maintenance or capital projects in the area of the plant that I work in. I oversee uh, budgets and contractors and seeing the project through the cradle of the grain. Okay. So what'd you get your degree in? I, I was a 2007 graduate of agricultural engineering. So, Ohio State. so how did that degree help prepare you for this position? That you're in? Uh, I think the engineering degree definitely helped me to think critically about solving problems and uh, a lot of the technical knowledge I don't necessarily use maybe as much as I thought coming out of school, but definitely the problem solving process, thought process that the engineering curriculum teaches you, I use every day. So, so we're here at the career fair and you're meeting with students, so what is it that you're looking for in a student or in their resume? Mm -hmm. Uh, big things that we're looking for in students and their resumes is probably the biggest thing is previous work experience. So I'd encourage um, any internships, co-ops, um, even if they aren't in the engineering field, like one thing that I was involved with, I was a Bible camp counselor for two summers, which I really feel helped, helped me develop communication skills and be able to talk to people and relate to junior hires, parents, um, sure, and, uh, and things like that. So get lots of work experience, that's one big thing we look for. Um, another thing is uh, that communication and leadership ability. We, we are here hiring leaders, and uh, so, you know, whether it's a club or a, uh, some group on campus, get involved in those groups, and not just, not just show up to the meetings, but really take a leadership role because um, we want to we want to hire those leaders so. so talk about how you're evaluated as an engineer within your company um, I'm evaluated in how I work with people so how I handle relationships with contractors and other co-workers whether they be uh, peer relationships or, or higher up or lower down um, and also the amount of work I accomplish. Um, I do a lot of project management, and so the quicker I can turn around projects and the higher quality they are, the, the better I look. So that's how I'm evaluated. So if you were to do it all again, go back to college, what would you do different than what you did the last time, if anything? Um, I would take more controls and instrumentation classes because one thing that uh, I deal with a lot is controls and instrumentation. And I know, I feel like I knew very little or not enough coming out of college and uh, have had to learn kind of the hard way on the job where if I would have taken more controls and instrumentation classes in college, it would have really helped. The other thing is I probably would take more um, finance and engineering economics type classes because in the business world, it's all about the bottom line and what return you can get out of projects and how this is gonna help the owners get a return on their assets and also help pay my salary, which is important. So, so how do you keep fresh? Do you take like continuous improvement courses or training or um, what? We keep fresh, actually at GPC we have a uh, foundations course, which is um, geared towards raising up new leaders within the company. And uh, a lot of that, so that's been, that's been a good way to keep fresh. Um, a lot of teamwork type, communicating type uh, fundamentals and ideas, working with coworkers, how to manage people well, um, that, that has really helped out. And then also uh, family life and community life, having, having a life outside of work is also good to balance work and life. So. Very good. Thank you. That's great. Yeah.